Trustee Jim Murren and philanthropist Heather Murren have invested $1 million in Howard University's Center for Women, Gender, and Global Leadership. The proposal for this center was spearheaded by Dr. J. Jarpa Dewani, an associate professor of political science at Howard University, and President Wayne A.I. Frederick. Proposed um, Center for Women, Gender, and Global Leadership at Howard University is going to build up on what Howard University has already been doing, which is preparing women for leadership at the national and international level. With this gift from Trustee and Mrs. Marin, we're hoping to scale up the work that has been done by making sure that as a research institution, we do provide and produce research that is grounded and that speaks to the realities of black women within the United States and the global diaspora. The Center for Women, Gender and Global Leadership here at Howard University uh, represents a significant and important strategic imperative that has been fulfilled in terms of getting it started. Uh, this would allow us to really look at policy, to look at the studies around these issues, and also to put that in a global context when you look at laws around the world. 70% of our undergrad students here at Howard are women, and I think it's important as we step in uh, to this next decade that we really make sure we emphasize and underscore not just the importance of these issues, but making sure that we impact policy around these issues, we impact laws around the globe, and we really give a platform uh, for our students and our faculty to study these issues and really leave their imprint on it. This center has been in the works for a while, but it is even more joyous to have the announcement made shortly after Howard alumni, Senator Kamala Harris's election to the Vice Presidency of the United States, an achievement that shatters many barriers and solidifies the need for more women in leadership. There couldn't be a more important moment in history to be able to invest in a center of excellence for women's leadership. We are in a world that is being fraught with um, unrest. We have a global pandemic that we're dealing with, and we have economies our own and around the world that are in free fall. And so it's never been more important than to invest in the assets that can bring us out of this, that can bring us together, that can grow our economies and to make us better as a society. And young, excellent women have played such a prominent role in so many areas that it really is time now to make sure that they have their rightful place in leadership that can take us in new directions and better directions as a whole. And there is no better place to make that happen than here at Howard University. Although there are no limitations to support, President Frederick mentioned that the financial goal for this center is $5 million, and donations can be made through giving.howard.edu forward slash center for women. This center is expected to launch in the spring, and although there is an allotted physical space for it, only time will tell whether or not that launch will be distant and virtual or in person. With Spotlight News, I'm Dariana Davis.